John Jones was just announced in the past week or so to be fighting Stipe Miocic in November at Madison Square Garden, which seems to be the place that the UFC goes now every year in November. They are making it an annual event where they go to MSG in New York City. And I have a few comments on that fight. <clears throat> I don't give a fuck. I don't care. This fight is so long overdue that it just doesn't matter anymore. Stipe Miocic will be 42 years old and not having fought a fight in like four years. John Jones will have been a champion holding a belt for almost two, a year and a half since he won the belt over Cyril Gone. I just don't have any interest. It doesn't have the buzz or the excitement that I would have want. What, what I think any fight fan would have hoped for. Because I'm on lots of MMA boards. And I can tell you that not a lot of people care about this fight that I see from what I'm reading. It doesn't have that, that, that pop. Because most people want to see John Jones fight Tom Aspinall, who is the interim champion. It's the fight that makes sense. It's the fight that people find as the most dangerous fight for John Jones. I don't find Stipe Miocic to be that dangerous a fighter at this point. He's 42 years old when they fight, not having fought in four years. Like, who gives a shit? If John Jones wins that fight, who cares? Does it prove anything? I mean, seriously, does it prove anything? I don't think it proves a thing. Because John Jones is John Jones, and he's a great, great fighter and arguably the greatest fighter ever. But the way his career is gone, <clears throat> he doesn't want to fight the fighter that everyone thinks is the biggest badass in the heavyweight division. And that's Tom Aspinall. Tom Aspinall is a monster. He hits hard. He's fast. He's strong. But if you think you're that dude, why won't you fight him? And don't give me this crap that John Jones is posting because he's been posting lots of nonsense, you know, comments about how recently it was a comment about Tom Brady and Tom Brady go win me two more Super Bowls. What? Because John Jones has the most title defenses and I guess he's got nine title defenses and Brady's got seven Super Bowls. Is he really comparing the Super Bowl to, to title defenses? <clears throat> because winning the Super Bowl in football is a lot harder than winning a championship in the UFC. It is, because it's a team sport. You're relying on too many other factors beyond yourself. To win a fight, you rely on yourself. So you control the outcome. You control who wins and who loses. Tom Brady doesn't control who wins and who loses. Tom Brady can only do his part on a football team, because if his defense gives up 45 points and he scores 42, <clears throat> he loses, even though he may have played great. I just don't have any interest in this fight. It, it doesn't excite me. I hope the rest of the card, it just doesn't jump off the page like it did a couple years ago. We wanted to see that fight three to six months after he fought Cyril Gaon. We didn't want to see the fight a year and a half later. It's just the way it is. There's too much, there are too many moving parts in the UFC that keep you excited about a fight. Thank you for watching Come On Now, the podcast. Please be sure to subscribe, like, comment, and ring that bell. So you get up to the minute updates when we publish new content. You can also find us on Facebook and Instagram at Come On Now Podcast and X and TikTok at Come On Now Pod. Thank you again for supporting this channel.